Davis was officially announced as the next men's basketball coach at North Carolina this afternoon. It was an emotional introduction for a man who dreamed of playing in Tar Heel Blue. Sports director Nick Carboni joins us from Uptown where North Carolina has a baseball game tonight. Nick, what stood out in Davis's comments today? Well, Fred, I think we got a sense of what his job interview must have been like over the weekend. He was passionate, he was emotional, and he showed dedication to one single place, the University of North Carolina. Since Hubert Davis was a boy growing up in Virginia, he wanted to be in Chapel Hill. Growing up, I had always wanted to walk out of that tunnel. Now he will do that as the 20th head coach in Heels history, following the legendary Roy Williams, who was right there rooting him on. And I absolutely love him to death. And I'm so thankful for just giving me a chance and giving me an opportunity. I can't believe that he's here today. But now it's Davis's program. He's the Carolina guy many were looking for, and he knows the team needs to improve to meet that standard. North Carolina is going to show up every game, every day, every second, every possession, North Carolina will be there. This was a quick process. Athletics director Bubba Cunningham said they did look at outside candidates, but spoke with dozens of former players. The feeling seemed to be keep it in the Carolina family. Even though Davis, an assistant for nine seasons, has no head coaching experience. I asked Locked on Tar Heels' Candace Cooper why that's the case. Because in this age where players are definitely using their voices more, they are expressing and entering transfer portals when they are not happy. So Hubert Davis brings a lot of recruiting experience. In fact, Davis is already trying to convince freshman center Walker Kessler to stay in Chapel Hill because to Davis, there's nowhere else he'd rather be. And I'm ready to go. Yeah, we'll have much more on that developing Kessler situation. Will he stay or will he go coming up at six? And I've seen a lot of coaching introductions. They don't get much more genuine, passionate, and dedicated than this one. If you missed it or you just want to watch it again because you were inspired by it, you can watch the whole thing on WCNC.com. Live at Truist Field, Nick Carboni for WCNC Charlotte.